Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to make these little crochet dolls with a plastic spoon as the head. So let's get started. Today I'm going to work with some cotton worsted yarn and a 5mm crochet hook. I'm going to begin with chain 5, slip stitch to join and form a ring. Chain 2, 1, 2, Make six and double crochet in the ring. One, two, six double crochet, slip stitch to join in the top of the first double crochet. Chain two, one, two, and turn. Double crochet in each stitch around. Double crochet in each stitch around. Okay, I'll double crochet in each stitch around at the end of the row. Slip stitch to join in the top of the first double crochet. Now you're going to repeat that for two more rows. Okay, and that's what that looks like. And it's going to form the dress. To make this section, chain three, single crochet in the next stitch. Chain three, one, two, three, single crochet in the next stitch. Repeat all the way around. Okay, I've worked all the way around. And now I'm just going to make another row of loops. So I'm going to chain three, one, two, three, single crochet in the next loop, chain three, single crochet in the next loop. So we're just going to do that for two more rows. Okay, I've done that for a few more rows. And the, the bottom is as long as the spoon. We're going to increase for this flounce along the bottom. And to do that, I'm going to chain three, one, two, three, single crochet in the same loop. Chain three, one, two, three, single crochet in the next loop. Chain three, one, two, three, single crochet in the same loop. So you're going to repeat that all the way around. Chain three, single crochet in the next loop, chain three, single crochet in the same loop. So you'll have twice as many all the way around. Okay, I have worked all the way around, and now I'm just going to slip stitch to join. And fasten off. So that's the bottom of the dress, and that will form the dress. To make the arms, I chained 16. I'm going to single crochet in the second stitch from the hook, and in each stitch all the way across the chain. Okay, I have chained 16, and I single crocheted in each stitch across the row, and now I'm going to tie a knot in the center and that will form the hands, like that. And so this will go on the front of the dress and it will get glued behind her back. I'm going to hot glue the dress on the spoon like that. Bring the, the um, hands in the front and I'm going to glue that on the back. So here and here. Okay, now we can tie all these yarn ends into a knot and trim them off. So there's what it looks like at this stage and you can weave this yarn in back into the finished work. To make the hat, chain five. One, two, three, four, five. Stitch to join and form a ring. Chain two. Make six double crochet in the ring.
slip stitch to join. Chain one. Single crochet in each stitch around. Like that. Chain two. One, two. Double crochet in the same stitch. Make two double crochet in each stitch around. One, two. One, two. Slip stitch to join. Chain two, one, two. Double crochet in the same stitch. Two double crochet in each stitch around. Okay, I double crochet in each stitch around. Now I'm going to slip stitch to join and fasten off. And there's the little hat. And that will fit to be stretched on over the head like that. Weave the yarn end into the finished work. To make the hair, wind yarn around your fingers approximately 20 times. Cut off another little piece. Slide the bundle off and tie it all together. Like that. Now I tied a bit of ribbon here where the waist would be. I'm going to hot glue this one at the chin. Slide the spoon into the hat like that. Turn it around. I'll glue the back of the hat to the back. Don't forget to dip your finger in water so you won't get burned. And to pat that in. I can flip it over. Place the hair over the head. Bring the hat back on. Glue the hair to the top of the head and the hat at the same time. Wet your finger and tuck that in like that. Now put some glue there and tuck the hair onto the face. Make a small bow and glue it on the top of the hat. If you want to use it as a Christmas ornament, make a hanger and tuck it right down inside the hat. And there you go. That's how you can make a cute little plastic spoon doll. And this one was made with regular Red Heart Super Saver and this is cotton worsted. To make a shorter doll, you can cut these plastic spoons with scissors. Smooth down the sharp edges with a nail file.